you can't really put this event in a box as far as slope style, as far as rails, as far as half pipe. You gotta be good at everything in order to do well in this event, which a lot of guys these days are specifically good in one event. And this kind of shows who the best all around snowboarder is on every single type of terrain. Okay, oh. guys, don't touch the course keys. You just got salted, right? So you keep yourself to the rider's right or the rider's left and just have a little look. Okay, poke around. Try not to slash it up too much yet. Okay, we want some of that going down later. Okay, now it's time to just check it out. Find your line. See what's out there. Three days of riding. Uh, we got a field of 16 men and five women, but it's being judged every day as these guys and gals are just lapping this ridiculous, super long course. This thing is sick. This thing is super chill. Sheesh. Super. Super uba chill. These are the kids who are like pushing it on this side of things, like in the park, in the slopes out contest, in the half pipe contest, like taking it to the next level. Trying to figure everything out, remember where everything is. It looks amazing. Dare I say, maybe better than the first year. It's a long one, so getting the top to bottom will be pretty impressive, that's for sure. Hanky, look, watch this, the bottom jump. He's coming in, regular. Butter to switch back nine. Oh no, switch back 10! Oh my god, god dude. Cow. The three day session leading up to finals gives them so much practice time on this course. The only difference is with recharged, practice actually does count. Right now, if I'm looking at who's been absolutely beating this course down, we're going Nick Mo. He's definitely got a bit of a mullet, I've noticed, which I've noticed. for me personally is kind of uh, of value, you know? Hankies has been just on a tear. Yeah. Winkleman is just swagoo beef on about every feature, and he's destroying the steel. Uh, women, Jamie. Jamie, here she comes. Yep. Yeah, Jamie. There it yeah, is. She's going to be a problem. First day up here, it's classic Cali weather, sunny. And the park looks awesome. Uh, we're going to give Dusty and Hendrickson the uh, sleep at the wheel award because he literally looks like he took a tranquilizer dart to the neck. Oh, wow. Let's go, Zeb. Seven. My boy Zeb is uh, pure entertainment value. I would say no regard for safety. You just throw him up in the air upside down, and he lands on his feet. It's just pure excitement. Even when he falls, he does a trick. Like, oh my god. <laughs> I would pay so much money to be able to do a frontside air like that. Danny Davis has the papers on the half pipe section. It's kind of uh, Danny's playground of punishment, we're calling it these days. Haley and Nora have been slaughtering that big jump. Small Sunglasses Big Energy Award goes to Raibu. It's not your traditional slope style course because it offers such a variety of features. We usually only do like 45 second long runs and this one's almost like two minutes long depending on how fast you're riding it. This could truly be a completely new discipline of snowboarding. You know, it's really kind of keeping Ben's vision of combining slope style, pipe, and really, you know, downhill mountain biking and all around snowboarding into one event, you know, being year two, uh, obviously we don't have the snow we had in the first year, but we were able to move over here to South Park and just given the resources and the commitment that Mammoth has to snowboarding and to an event like this, we we're really able to get creative and uh, produce something I think that's very unique. It's really sick too, cause like I grew up riding this run and then to see it transform, like this is super rad. It was an 18 day build. We spent honestly about 13 to 14 days of that build just farming the snow. You know, in a typical year, there would have been an eight to 10 foot base of snow all around this area, and we wouldn't have had to go very far for the snow. 
Uh, in a year like this, we actually had to go all the way out to the bottom of the Abbey Chutes behind me on Lincoln. Just had to do a ton of snow farming because the base was only around three to six feet. Everybody out here is a little, maybe a little more competitive mindset, but all the homies out here just having a good time. Just kind of going into it as trying to get a dope clip. <laughs> This really kind of determines who's the best overall because you have a little bit of everything. You got some, some technical rails, you got some transition, you got some solid jumps. So really, if you're lacking in one department, you're not gonna make the final who can just beat down every single type of terrain. And, and there's a couple standouts. It's, it's super impressive watching these guys ride. Usually a slope style course is about six features. We're looking at probably 10 to 15 different features through this whole course. So the boys are going to be sore, but we're going to be giving it all we got. The most extraordinary thing about this course is just how long it is. It's almost a mile long. I can't think of any competitive snowboard event where it's had a mile long run before. Like you get to the bottom and everyone's like, <sighs> so you just ran an 800 meter dash or something. To be able to do a full pull on everything without falling will be impressive. It's a lot of features. I saw Brock just do a top to bottom laced, flowing like the salmon of the Capistrano, if you will. Kid's a problem. That's very close to uh, accurate. <laughs> I just tried to fish my way through the course, you know? OK, so we're going to whittle it down to, initially it was six men, three gals. Uh, we made the call to go eight because it was just too hard to cut it down to six and wish we could go 10, because it was really hard to cut it down to eight. Uh, everyone crushed it. We got about an hour and five minutes until the judges kind of head down to that table, and we deliberate, and we come up with our uh, eight men and three women. So it's about to get pretty interesting here, I think. <laughs> 